Hey y'all, it's Coco Jones, and I am gonna be prank calling my friends and family, everyone in my contact list. This is phoning it in. Honestly, I've been so busy, I haven't been returning a lot of people's calls, so I feel like they're all gonna be a little salty with me. Where you been? Working. All right, let's do this. This one is too much. You guys, say the Grammys are rescinding your nominations and you're not sure why. I think I'm gonna call Terrell on this one. Terrell is my bestie. He's actually like huge in the music industry himself. He has an amazing Terrell show platform. Dear God, I'm so scared. Hi. You're not gonna believe this. What happened? You okay? I'm just like beside myself. Tell me why the Grammys are rescinding my nominations. What? No, no, no. Terrell, yes. What are you talking about? I don't, I don't know why. We're shook. Me and my team are shook right now. What is the reasoning? I don't have an answer. I want to know myself. They're, they're making calls. We're, we're scrambling. Um, have you ever heard of something like this? Never in my life. There's no way. Hold on. I know. It's all over the news. Google it. I don't see anything. Yeah, that's because that's a prank, baby. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm with L. I'm with L. I'm with L Magazine right now. I'm doing a prank segment. I'm so rare. Thank you so much. Love you. Call you later. Bye. That was hilarious. I'm so sorry, Terrell. The next prompt, pretend you just found this phone and you're trying to return it to the owner. This time, I'm going to call LMA. I'll see if she picks up. Dear Lord, be offense. Hello? Hi, oh my God, like, I just found this phone and I'm like, not sure who to call, but like, I recognize your name because you're like a celebrity or something like that. And I was just like wondering, could you like help me like find the owner of this phone? Because you're like boot up, right? Girl. Good morning. Hey, girl. Girl, listen. <laughs> I'm doing this damn segment with Elle Magazine. Girl, they got me prank calling people. Oh, I'm like, why is she? I was listening to like, why is she calling me? But that was terrible. I for sure knew that was you. I knew you didn't lose your phone. OK, you got a good point, because you know I wouldn't lose my phone. <laughs> Plus, I always have several voices when we're around each other. But thank you for playing along for those 0.2 seconds. Hey, Elle. <laughs> I'll call you later. All right, bye. Bye. She knew I wouldn't lose my phone. All right, so this next prompt, quote, your tummy hurts verse. <laughs> I feel like I could do this to my mom because the first line is about the Bible and she is a very, very high faith woman. <laughs> I'm really nervous, I'm shaking in my boots. Hey, cool. Baby, go open a Bible. Because God Please. knows that sin is a cycle. Hello? Lie to my face. It's your hobby. Boy, you fine as hell for a psycho. Courtney, are you OK? <laughs> Courtney, say something. Mom, I'm not in danger. Oh my God. <laughs> What's wrong? You think that that's what I would do if I was in danger? Like you were not talking to me, but you needed me to hear. Mom, no, no, this is not an emergency. I'm actually doing a prank call segment with Elle Magazine, and so I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh, girl, don't be doing that, man. I'm sorry, Mom. Do you allow Elle Magazine and its partners to air this recording? I need a verbal consent, yes. Are you kidding me? No. I'm saying no. Mom! <laughs> Mom, come on now, this is for work. No. Mom, are you serious? I gotta tell them what I just did. No, you just need to say the word yes. Yes. Love you. Bye. Bye. Not my mom thinking I was literally in danger. <laughs> she was like, Courtney, are you okay? Like, she was really planning my rescue mission. That is so sad. This next prompt, immediately start crying and ask for forgiveness and just keep apologizing. Okay. I'm gonna call my girl and my co-star on Bel Air, Simone. Come on, Simone. Rooting for you, girl. Hey, Oh my God, hello? 
Simone, I'm so sorry. Baby, what's going on? I'm just so sorry, Simone. What's going on? I shouldn't have done that to you. I'm so sorry, Simone. Baby, what happened? So basically, I told Jalen that this is a prank call. I'm gonna beat somebody's ass! <laughs> <laughs> Girl, I'm over here with Elle Magazine. You are live, babes. Oh, my God. <laughs> First of all, the Oscars after the Grammy because I am so sick of you. <laughs> oh, my God, my heart is freaking crying. <laughs> I'm so sorry, darling. Thank you. I'll call you later. Hello, Elle. Okay, that was a good one. <laughs> so good. Woo! This is work. This one will be funny. Okay, okay, okay. Ask someone to Venmo you $30 for lunch because you lost your wallet last night. I'm gonna call my little sister. She's always asking me for money. Enjoy this girl. Get to taste your own medicine. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message. Emergency pick up, please. Hello? Hey girl, um, I need a favor like really bad, please. What? Can you Venmo me $30 for lunch? I literally lost my wallet. Yeah, are you okay? Yes, girl, I'm so sorry. Actually, can you Venmo me 100 Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, but damn, what's going on? I was at the freaking club last night, girl, and I cannot find my wallet. And now I have to pay for lunch. Actually, it's lunch for everybody, girl, and they're really ordering a lot. And I said uh, it was on me. It might be around like 400, 500. Babe, babe. babe. Yes, it's emergency, Aj. Courtney, hmm? Courtney, you're clearly lying. I was gonna keep going with it, but I personally have a lot of stuff going on right now. And the fact that you would ever do this to me is so absolutely crazy. This is the most unbelievable thing that has ever been told to me, ever. And if you're calling me from your phone, then you have Apple Pay. I know that because you have sent me so many Apple Pays. Well, um, this is actually a segment on Elle Magazine, so you're live, babes. <laughs> I'm so serious, girl. You really ate me up there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Say hi to Elle Magazine. Is this a joke? No, girl. You want me to put you on FaceTime? <laughs> girl, don't do that. If, it, if you turn the camera and there's actually like a studio there. The, uh, girl, I'm fully on set. Courtney, keep speaking to me and tell me these lies and I'm gonna faint. Okay, girl, I'm FaceTiming you because you must think I'm kidding. Like, come on now. Pick up, pick up the phone. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> oh God, at least I ate you up. You did, you raggedy trout. You're forgiven for that eat up, because that makes good TV. Bye, girl. Bye, girl. Bye, girl. <laughs> That's hilarious. This one is good. Tell someone you're being canceled. I'm going to call my best friend, Jalen. Cordy. Um, I'm freaking out a little bit. Why? Girl, I think I'm about to get canceled. Why? Girl, Girls, no. Yes, no, listen. You know how I get when I'm turned. Okay. Basically, I went to the club. I literally Last black. Night. Yes, girl, literally blacked mm -hmm. out. I don't remember even doing this. So basically, like, there's this video of me going off on some man outside the club, and I was blacked out. I don't even remember this. What? Yes, girl, I think I'm about to get canceled. Oh my God, did you watch it? I am not watching it. My publicist is telling me don't even do it because she knows that I'll freak out. She watched it though, and they haven't even spoken to me. They're like trying to figure it out. No. They also told me that I low-key like put my hands on him, like fought. I think I got into a what? fight. Yes. What? Who are you with? Francis. Francis did not stop you? How is Francis gonna stop me? You know how I get. You know how crazy I can be. Do you want me to watch it for you and then tell you what you said? Yeah, girl, I can send it to you. But just, oh if it's God, if it's too bad, just like lie to me or something. Cause I'm literally gonna like pass out. Oh my gosh, girl, trust me when I say you're going to be okay. I know it's a freak out, but people have done worse. No, like, girl, I'm literally... serious, Jalen. You know I can't handle stuff like this, bro. I'm about to have a girl, freak out. you're joking with me right now. You're not. Ah! Yeah, girl, it's a prank. <laughs> I'm actually with Elle Magazine. You're live right now. Oh, my.
my gosh, bitch. Girl, it's too early. I know, friend. I'm sorry. But thank you so much for the support. Love you. And I hate to put yes. you on the spot like that. Elle Magazine, that was a lot of fun and very nerve-wracking. Check out my vinyl of my debut EP, What I Didn't Tell You, this February 16th. I'm going to go get a glass of water.